Um, uh. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you know from YouTube, there's loads of like male celebrity hair tutorials around, isn't there? So many. Um, and obviously a huge part of having this male celebrity's hairstyle is the actual cut. You know, styling can do so much, but it's really important to have the correct haircut, I suppose. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, otherwise you can't actually do the style you're after. So what I've done today is I've taken some of the most Googled men of 2015 and also um, the guys that there seems to be a lot of hair tutorials about, if that makes sense. And um, I've got my friend here, Scott, who is an international art director for Tony and Guy. And we're gonna go through the celebrity pictures and he's gonna tell you exactly what you need to ask your hairstylist or barber to get this hairstyle. Does that make sense? Okay, so first of all we have Old Zane. So I guess lengthwise you're gonna ask for like a number two, probably the short back and sides, the really textured messy look on top. Cool. And then New Zane. New Zane, so basically it's a skinhead. So a yeah. 0 0.5 skin fade, number one, probably a two about on top I would say. Cool. Man bun Zane. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so a skin fade through the sides and a disconnected length on top. So when you're doing a man bun, what do you do with your hair while you're growing out this long so, man bun on top? Like, would you start doing that? Yeah, so ideally keep the sides really short straight away because it makes it look longer on top. And don't put it into the man bun until it's ready to go up, otherwise so it's nothing worse it. than having that little, like, hi. hi. Ronaldo. Um, so you've got a, a skin fade again with a hard part, so again, something that's shaving in, uh, and again a disconnected sweepy length on the side. Cool. This isn't new David Beckham, but this is like typical David Beckham. Yeah, again, it's quite a classic shape, so I doubt it's with the clippers, so a really soft scissor over kind on the back and the sides, and a quiff length with texture. Baptiste. Uh, again, quite similar to the David Beckham one, but this is a bit more disconnected and a bit more softer on the side. So length, I'd say two, and then lengthwise on top, it's quite outgrown and quite undone, but more polished than the other ones. Okay, so a di disconnect... A disconnected shape, yeah. And disconnected means where you haven't got like a... So it's shorter, and then it's longer, and hangs Just over. Just like sudden. Yeah. Okay, Zac Efron. So this is more of a grown out kind of texture crop. Um, so something that's more like a one finger's depth lengthwise on the sides. Uh, and again, something really outgrown, really undone. I think product wise, what that's what makes the actual image is something quite waxy, like a pomade. Yeah, because the sides don't look, they look long, they don't look any shorter than... No, well, it's all kind of pushed back to make it look short. Yeah. It's quite a nice little styling variation. Cool. Oh, Ryan Gosling. Oh, this is quite a nice image. So again, it's got quite like a side part to it. So quite a natural, I guess, length on top. Um, lengthwise on the sides, about a two and a three. Maybe one on the sides. Cool. But again, you know, it's, it's all on product. I think that's what's making these images. Yeah. Uh, old Justin Bieber. <laughs> but very popular hair. Very Justin popular. Bieber. Yeah. So again, it's quite a disconnected shape. So lengthwise, we've got a one and a half, one on the sides. And again, you're seeing his disconnected lengths come through quite a lot. So something that's quite textured again and quite rounded around the crown. So you get that real flat area. So I guess what you're going to ask for, for this one is a number one on the sides, probably faded to like a number two, and disconnected and textured on top. Cool. Lucky Blue Smith. Um, again, you're seeing quite a square build up of weight through the sides. So again, disconnected, but really square and kind of quite modern, I guess, through there and really, really long on top. And again, product is key, so a max wax is gonna be perfect for this, to get that real groomed effect. So this is this is new Lucky Blue Smith, but it's just the other one grown out. Yeah, right? it, it looks cool though. Yeah, yeah. so it's literally just grown out It's just literally there. kept it long. It looks good though, it's I really long. Like it. yeah. yeah. Mariano de... Mariano. <laughs> <laughs> again, really similar to like the previous ones. You see the disconnected shape and a lot longer on top and just really pushed and swept off the face. So number two on the sides. Cool, and then finally, Nick Jonas. So this is probably a grey that's all the same length, so number two or three, all over. So everyone we've looked at, we've pretty much had the same kind of haircut, but like you were saying, the product really does make it. Right, so would you say that this is kind of the haircut to get if you want to be able to create most of the modern stuff? I think so. Okay, definitely. so what is that? What is so that? What as a, as a, as a, as a general, general haircut that Guys should have to get every kind of modern day hair style. What what is so that? So it's pretty much short back and sides. Number one, probably a half, and a disconnected length on top that you can push back and forward and side to side. There we go. Really simple, straight to the point. But that's exactly what we wanted. Um, I'm gonna write everything in the description below, um, every celebrity and what you need to ask for. But yeah, that's it. I hope you found it helpful. Thank you, Scott. That's okay. And I will see you soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs>